Welcome back. We're with Scott and Michelle Williams now in the kitchen making a Mexican sweetheart soup. Not something I feel like you typically eat on Valentine's that's Day, right. but I love this. And it all centers around the start of the dish. And so that's kind of how it all evolved. What you said is jicama. Jicama. Yes, okay. it looks like jicama, but it's jicama. It and what is with it? It's actually a root vegetable okay. that grows in really warm weather. So it's a really common. Um, there it is. Yes, it is. it's actually kind of like a... Um, a root okay. uh, vegetable that um, is similar to a combination of a turnip and an apple and a potato. Can you find this in the grocery store? Oh right yeah, now? yeah, just Kroger. Kroger. Really? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you, know, you want to. You've got to make sure that you peel it, but it is loaded with a lot of hydration, good fiber, low in calories, low glycemic index. It's just a superstar, and a lot of people don't know about it. Perfect. Yeah. Well, and I like that you cut it out in little heart shapes. See, that's how. Yeah, right. we, we we think of a vegetable, and then we create everything else around it. <laughs> Very smart. So it yes. started over here. Yep. So basically what we did is we took in, uh, took um, onions and garlic mm -hmm. and started to kind of just saute that down a little bit. Okay. And then added in from there jalapenos and then brought in our spices Ooh. at the end at that point. And just let those marry in so they kind of are really good together. Okay. And then from there brought in some red pepper and some fire roasted stewed tomatoes. That sounds really let good. Let that cook a little bit longer from that point. Is this really spicy? Um, no, 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 no. It's no, just you can always just like anything you can cater it to your preference. Okay. We kind of kept everything low and just sort of mellow. And uh, last thing we want is heartburn on Valentine's Day, That's right? right. right. <laughs> so, we little, that. so then we brought in a little shrimp for some light protein. Okay. Some fresh lime, and then to top it off at the end, we did uh, spiral zucchini and some jicama and some cilantro. Ooh, that sounds yeah, delicious. Yeah, the, the good thing about this dish and any of our dishes is they can kind of be steered in any direction. So this can easily be a vegetarian dish. Since we started with a vegetable broth, all you would want to do is just omit the shrimp for this. Perfect. Now we chose to also accent it with just a little bit of avocado for an essential fat mm -hmm. and for fun because they could be cut with the heart-shaped cutters, <laughs> some white mozzarella. Uh, so and you got the heart-shaped dishes. You yeah. Yes, exactly. So, you know, it just makes it fun in the cilantro. And so it's all very, very easy to make and fun for the family. This dish actually serves four. So if you okay. want to have a family Valentine's or meal with and the it, kids, and I like that. It's cozy with this kind of temperature that's sure going on going to be still. Cold tomorrow night. Yeah. Yeah. It is going to be cold, if but. If Mike could just fix the weather. That's right. You know? <laughs> but we realize spring is on the way. It's coming. It's so coming. spring is coming. So don't forget us when you're looking for your fitness goals to get, re get ready for spring break. All right. Sounds good. Let's and we're going to have this recipe on our website at WBR.com. Good to see you both. You Happy Valentine's Day.